Hi, in this video we're going to teach you how to build highways with the traffic system. Uh, now, what we want to do is make this the anchor and we're going to build our highway off in this direction. It's important to note that the traffic system is headed in this direction for blue and this direction in pink. <coughs> now we always link anchor to edit via the blue as default um, and the blue is headed in this direction so technically we'd be linking from anchor to edit and going in this direction uh, with a normal linking process so what we want to make sure is that we're going to be linking back this way in the opposite direction of the blue so we've got a little helper function with that um, let me just give you an example of what happens if we don't use that helper function. Now, we put a straight line down and you can see here that because it links anchor to edit with the blue direction, the, the nodes here are swapped, so our traffic's going in the wrong direction. If we, if we turn on auto reverse anchor to edit, first we'll just get rid of that node. If we turn this on, when we go to place the next node it switches it around so that it thinks these two are opposite and we do get the correct direction and that's what we want to do because we're actually going in uh, the reverse of the blue direction because we're building out that way. Now that's not anything to do with the highway but that's going to help you out later on because um, you will run into these situations where uh, sometimes the direction is switched and you want to build back the other way. Okay, let's move on to the uh, building of the highway. Save that one out. Keep on our uh, reverse because we're going back this way. And let's put in a four lane uh, entry piece. Now, also worth noting is because we're going back this way, uh, it's actually an exit piece because the blue will be exiting into a two lane. So instead of it being an entry piece, which we'll put the entry piece in, we'll see what happens. Uh, even if we rotate that around and flip it, we're going to see it's going in. The, there's some local nodes going in the wrong direction because it is actually an entry piece. The, the traffic enters this way. So even though the primary node is correctly linked up, uh, the local ones aren't. So what we want to do is get rid of that and put it as an exit and that looks a lot better. So keep in mind blue is the is the default direction you want to always be trying to go in. Okay, that's the uh, technically the entry piece or exit piece to our highway. Save that out. Let's put a few straight pieces in. Uh, turn on our quick form. So that's our four lane highway. <clears throat> then we also have our six lane. They can go off our four lane. Put a few more of them in. And then we'll start to close this one down. So we put in the appropriate pieces. And a few more of them. And that's it. That's our four and six lane highway done. Save that out. And we'll probably quickly link up a intersection just so we can get the traffic going around and going back onto the uh, the highway and then we can show you what's going to happen. So bear with me for a sec while I get this sorted.
Okay, so that's linked the highway up. So we will also drop in the, the traffic lights. And we'll get our spawners. Spawn them here. Okay, we're good to test it out. Now, just before we get started, I'd just like to run over a couple of new things with the vehicles to do with the traffic, uh, the highways. Just drop them in here. There is a magento, uh, magenta sphere now included, which is the vehicle highway check. Uh, if this is enabled, the you can set these two properties to uh, determine where it sits, depending on what um, your vehicle sizes are. And if that's enabled, it just basically looks for a vehicle in front, and if it hits a vehicle, it determines whether it can actually change lanes into a better lane to get past that vehicle. So that's just an added option for uh, automatically changing lanes. You'll probably want to use that one, and it's a, it's enabled by default. Okay, let's have a look. So as you can see the cars on the outside are going in the slow lanes and the cars on the inside are going in the fast lanes. And if they hit a car, which we'll try and find, this guy's gonna go no. Oh. Oh, everything seems to be working, but I just can't find an example for you. Uh, this guy's gonna move over because he just decided, yeah, I need to get over. Anyway, that's the uh, that's the highways for you. And there seems to be a bit of a traffic jam.